There's no real proof that Joseph Smith ever said anything about the black people couldn't hold the priesthood in our church. It usually came from Brigham Young, and that's kind of where it started. And then it was ended right around the time when the federal government basically said, hey, like, if you don't, then we're going to come after you. Yeah, and to defend the LDS and ultimately the FLDS is a lot of the rules and expectations were built before the Civil War. And so a lot of the foundation of those two churches was built before the Civil War when before then all the black were slaves so that culture created the rules that they were living by i think that's one of the reasons why it's hard to look back at some of the things that early prophets said and you go "Ooh, that was a little crazy sometimes it's because one we don't understand the culture and then the other piece that we've talked about they're men they're human they are human trying to do the best that they can in the culture but do they have bias absolutely they do they were raised by a mom and a dad just like we were you know what i'm saying like they had people that influenced them and the way they thought and then they maybe formed some of it in their own soundtracks themselves but their culture where they lived what part of the world they lived in and their mom and their dad and their aunt and their uncle and their grandma and grandpa that all has a play into how they're going to respond to certain things